I have a haul that let me tell you when I found this stuff at the Dollar Tree store, I the thought that the the words that came to my mind was this can't be real. So today I have no idea how I'm titling this video, something maybe along the lines of like a crafter's dreams. Um but it's basically things either between really amazing planner things and then just things for DIY. So just whatever kind of crafter you are, I found amazing stuff at Dollar Tree in this round. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at everything. The first thing are these little jars. How cute are they? But they have a farmhouse twist to them, which has a little barbed wire accent twisted around the top there. I found this to be very interesting. I had not seen these before and I like to buy in threes in case I want to make a centerpiece and for whatever reason, I buy in threes for centerpieces. I don't know. Anyone else? These are just going to be gorgeous. They could just be great standalone the way they are. You could add some really cute floral accents. You could put these in your guest bathroom and cut up little chunks of soap which would be really adorable um that would be a nice cute little farmhouse element there's just so many little things that you could do with these jars i'm gonna hold on to these for maybe christmas time we'll see what i end up doing with them but for a dollar and you get the little farmhouse element i thought this was definitely a crafter's dream here are some new games these are going to be great as stocking stuffers i know it's a little soon but i am going to be throwing out some suggestions for stocking stuffers just because I always tend to get stumped by stockings every year I don't know why but I found Dino War Crazy Eights and Old Maid and I just have to show you guys how cute the packaging looks like would you believe this was a dollar I, I just don't believe it I also want to point out that if you're a Dollar Tree enthusiast I want to point out that the label says Crown Jewels Kids I've never seen crown jewels have the term kids attached to it. So it makes me wonder what else in this line is gonna show up at Dollar Tree. So keep your eyes open in case you're interested in that. This one is gonna be pretty random, but I have to say that I have actually been searching for this for more than two years and I finally found it. But it is a pack of farm animals. I've never seen this at Dollar Tree. Maybe your ears has carried it for a while now, but this is the first time I've seen it and I have been on the hunt, like I said, for a very long time. And it's just a pack of just little toys. It has horses and cows and pigs and goats in here. And I have been wanting to do some DIYs with like farmhouse type animals. Usually they carry either individual animals like a horse, but it's really, really big or they carry more like safari animals, not so much farmhouse. So the fact that I found these, I was just like, really? I just I honestly didn't think it would ever happen. And here you go. So if you're like into crafting and you're into the farmhouse element, these may be really cute to pick up, especially if you want to do little details in your kid's room. All right, next up, I actually found some new Sassy and Chic, which is a makeup spa type brand at Dollar Tree. And I found some new makeup brushes. And they're the ones that have kind of been trendy. I don't know if, I don't typically see YouTubers use these brushes all that often. I think it was just like a one hit wonder maybe type of deal. But I found a foundation brush, an eyeshadow brush, and a contour brush. I don't know, I think the contour brush, maybe it's the right size, but the quality looks great. I have no idea. I've never heard of using one of these for an eyeshadow brush and then you get a foundation brush so I don't know these are are these a great steal I don't know let me know what you think and what kind of makeup brushes you use but found these at Dollar Tree the next thing is also makeup related and it's LA colors it's a lipstick but what's unique about this lipstick is that they're calling it a cosmic topper so you put it on top of a lipstick and it's showing you what it will look like. So here's your regular, and then when you apply this, it looks like this. So it gives it that nice, like, metallic-y sheen. And the reason why I picked this up is I've been watching Bachelor in Paradise, and not to make this too long, but Katie, I believe that's her name, Katie, the one with the gorgeous eyes, she wore a Jeffree Star um, metallic lip color, and she had posted on her Instagram about it, and it was this beautiful pink, and it's it was identical 
to this look right here. And she remarked that she had gotten her lipstick from Jeffree Star, but when I went on his website, yada yada yada, it was sold out. Anyway, I found this at Dollar Tree for a dollar. So I thought I'd give it a try. Um, so I just wanna let you guys know why I bought this. I found some more Lily Jane products, and the last time that I had hauled a bunch of hair accessories, you guys were telling me how great of a deal this was because Lily Jane was uh, a, more than a dollar. I found more stuff. Look at these fun barrettes or whatever they call these little clips. Oh my god, the colors alone are amazing. They're very glittery. And just looking at this, I just love all of the colors put together. And I thought these were really fun. And then look at this style. Butterflies, and then you get two gold, two silver, a big, and a mini. I'm going to take these to my niece and then we can just like play makeup and stuff like that. She's very, very girly. And I think that she would love like clipping things on and, and stuff like that. So this is definitely for her. And this right here, these are scrunchies. How gorgeous. And you get four of these gorgeous scrunchies for a dollar. And then look at the color selection. Stunning. I wish I would have found neutrals like grays, black, white brown but i i could not believe that this is there for a dollar i'm actually going to send these to my daughter so they'll end up in a care package somewhere because scrunchies are in apparently all right you're probably wondering where's the crafters dream stuff now we're gonna get into it i found a magnetic list pad it's brand new i really like the fun image on the back I just love the strawberries and the orange and the blueberry. This is definitely unique. I've never seen Dollar Tree carry a list pad like this before. And it says, sweet life. And you get the magnet on the back. I found a fun sticker book. Mm, okay, not crafter's dream, but I wanted to show you guys how interesting this sticker book is. It says, funny faces. And when you look through here, when you flip through this, you see that she has absolutely no face. Uh, but then you flip to the center here and you get a bunch of different eyes. You get a bunch of different noses and mouth to create her own funny face. So I thought that was a really interesting little activity book and I definitely had to share this with you guys. Maybe a crafter's dream, not only for adults, but for kids. This is definitely adorable and I'm bringing this to my niece. All right. Look at this crafting book that I found for a dollar. Uh, hemp macrame, am I saying that correct? Uh, easy boho chic designs. And then when I flipped through this, it shows you so many ways to make a bracelet. This is awesome. I have to tell you guys, if you have a teen girl or teen boy or whatever, these bracelets, these homemade type bracelets are very in very trendy my daughter wears stacks of them on her wrist and on her ankles so the fact that this book is a dollar and i love homemade gifts so i'm definitely going to use this and make my daughter some homemade bracelets for christmas and put these like in her stocking so i'm super excited to give these a try and i wanted to show you that it just shows you step by step how to make bracelets and they even add little charms like look at this one that one's really cool. Next up, I found more Crafter Square stuff, which I didn't even know was a brand at Dollar Tree until I recently hauled something not too long ago. But look what I found. I found a ton of paint pens. What? Are you kidding me? This is insane. And it says that it's ideal for wood, plastic, metal, and glass. So if you're into DIYs, and you're into watching DIYs on YouTube, they've got some paint pens for you guys. Purple, there's great colors like silver, and black is great, white is gonna be great as well. You've got a metallic gold, which is awesome, a green, a pink, there was also a purple, and I don't think I picked that one up for whatever reason, and then that, that blue, and again, that's silver. So, what? And then it just kind of shows you the broad line and the or the stroke of the paint pen all right next up is a name brand product i know all about it because i watch 
a YouTuber who loves this sticker brand or this crafting brand. Dollar Tree is selling Jolie's Boutique. I, can't, I don't even know what this cost originally. I honestly don't even know. And these are flower stickers because when you turn them around, you get the little sticker backing here. And I only found these two colors, but look how gorgeous these are. You guys, Jolie's Boutique stickers are stunning. Go to Hobby Lobby Michaels, take a look at them. They're gorgeous. I never in my wildest dream did I think Jolie's Boutique would ever find its way to Dollar Tree. I, I definitely was shocked. I'm still shocked. And then I found these as well, which are dimensional stickers. These are because Jolie's Boutique is a sticker shop. So look how gorgeous these are. These are gonna be really beautiful for some DIYs. And they're, I know, I know they're, well, they're more than a dollar. So the fact that they're a Dollar Tree, I don't even know what to say. All right, then back to some Dollar Tree brands. I found some Jot Planner stickers. I don't know if I have these in my collection or not. I probably do, but I found this little pink, black, and gold set. And then this one, which has a New York and travel theme, which I really liked. I hope one day I can go to New York and do all the New York touristy things. This is a new sticker sheet. As soon as I saw it, I was like, yes, I have to have that in my collection. I love anything that has sweets on it. And just how cute are the ice cream cones though? Like, is that not the cutest thing you've ever seen? Isn't that, oh, this little ice cream sundae. Oh, and this cake. By the way, in case you're interested, speaking of cake, I'm gonna start a new series on my vlog channel where I'm trying Natasha's Kitchen's recipes. I don't know if you know who she is, but she has like a Facebook and a YouTube and she's one of those like cooking, but the videos are really quick and they show you how to make easy recipes. There's a chocolate cake she made that I'm trying, so stay tuned. All right, the very last things I'm, it's the Sticko Collection, which is a name brand. Yes, I found this at Dollar Tree. I'm just as shook as you are. And you guys, this stuff is like, four to five bucks, if not even more, especially this one. But let's take a look at this one first. These are just sticker letters, but they're kind of like the wood chip kind, so they're a little thick. But it has a Bollywood theme for me because it looks like white, or like henna, like a henna tattoo kind of thing. And so look how gorgeous. Oh my, are you kidding me? At Dollar Tree? What? How? Someone needs to explain this to me. And then I found a huge pack, a value pack of six sheets of sticker letters and it just shows you what the six look like. It's all black and white and has a faux chalk board look. These are gonna be great if you wanna, again, craft, DIY, planner stuff. Six sheets of sticker letters, sticker letters alone at Hobby Lobby and Michaels are very, very expensive. So these are always gonna be a steal at Dollar Tree, just always. Even the ones that they make from like Jot that you've seen me haul for years upon years, the, the green one, the navy, the red, um, always going to be a great value for your buck are these sticker letter sheets. I, I wish I had more to share with you guys. I was so blown away that I found Jolie's Boutique and Sticko at Dollar Tree. I'm, I need to leave this video and go hunt more Dollar Tree stores and see if I can find anything else. But good luck. I hope that you guys find whatever it is that you're looking for. I hope that you enjoyed this haul. We took a little break from fall stuff and Halloween stuff, but stay tuned because my next haul, I found some adorable Halloween goodies. So I can't wait to share that with you guys. And a kitchen and decorate for fall is coming as well. So if you're interested in that, don't forget to subscribe and hopefully I'll see you guys there. Bye.